Good morning. Uh, I'd like to talk, uh, talk about, uh, I'm traveling to my work, um, and I'd like to sort of discuss a little bit sort of topic about uh, entanglement. Entanglement of uh, um, two particles that originate from one particle. And many fishes, they, uh, they are baffled by uh, the fact that if they measure one property of one particle of the, of the pair, that immediately at the same time, uh, the information of the other particle is known as well. And no matter about the distance. Well, suppose that we have a part created a, a, a particle pair uh, here on Earth, and one particle we keep on uh, here on Earth, and the other particle we uh, we allow it to be transported to the moon. And then we measure the spin or whatever kind of property. And then we already know what the, the, the feature, the same feature will be uh, of the other particle on the moon. And uh, scientists are baffled uh, that apparently it takes no time um, to, for the information to be revealed of the other particle. Well, but they, the physicists apparently forget one thing. Um, the, the thing is, we allow the particle already to travel. And if you're talking about the light, uh, uh, two light, two photons, two light particles, then the maximum speed that has already uh, been uh, used up is the speed of light. So the only thing what you do is revealing uh, the identity of, in this case, the spin. And by doing that, uh, you automatically reveal the, the information about the, 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 the spin of the other particle, which is the opposite. If you have a spin up here on Earth, then it will be spin down on the Moon, and vice versa. Um, but people, the physicists, forget that the particle already travels at the uh, most maximum possible speed, and that is the speed of light. Um, if you're talking about electrons, uh, of course the speed will be lower, but uh, the particle already travels. The only thing what you do is revealing the information and nothing more and nothing less. So the information has already apparently been taken uh, alongside with, with the particle itself. The only thing what you do is reveal it. And apparently that needs no speed because the information is already present in the particle pair, which is logical because it, it's a whole uh, 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 sphere. Oh, I can turn to the topic. No, right. And so the particle pair uh, 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 takes information, apparently, uh, during the travel, and, and the only thing is what you do is lift up the, the, the curtain of the information, and uh, doing so, uh, the curtain also pulls away on the other side, apparently, by which means the, the, um, uh, the information of the other particle is revealed as well. I have to drive again. So it seems counterintuitive, but thinking of it more closely, it is not counterintuitive, it is very intuitive. Because it's one uh, system, it is one complete system. One particle is linked to the other as, as a whole, uh, uh, complete system. And, well, that's what I want to share with you. And, uh, I, of course, I have to find out the math behind it. But, um, it flew over and has worked out well. Uh, so, um, the physicists seem to guess that the, the particle already travels. That's the whole uh, uh, issue, the whole, the whole point of the issue. And that's what I want to uh, make clear. Okay, thanks for watching. Bye bye. Hasta la See you next time.